Hey guys, it's Anna, welcome back to my channel. It's been a hot minute since I've actually filmed or uploaded anything. Um, this month's super crazy busy for me. I've just been out of it. I've been sick for like a month now. So that's a big reason. So I'm really sorry that I've been so bad at uploading. This is horrible. I literally have uploaded one video since prom, which was two weeks ago. And I usually upload three videos a week, so. That's how this month's going for me. Like I said, this month's really busy with school because I'm graduating. I have a lot of stuff going on. So, yeah, it'll get better soon. <laughs> so it is now, wow, it is May. I thought I would sit down and do my monthly favorite since I really haven't filmed much. You guys don't really know what I've been liking. So, yeah. I have nothing else to say, so yeah, let's just go ahead and get right on into the video. Okay, so this month I actually got a bunch of new drugstore products, and these are my faves. First, the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. Guys, this stuff is so good. This is like $5. It has the spatula applicator, which some people don't like because it's not very um, cleanly, but I actually kind of like it, so. <laughs> yeah, this foundation is so good. It goes on so smoothly on your skin. It's Pretty good coverage, you can definitely build it up, and it's formulated specifically to not have flashbacks, so that's really good, especially for um, flash photography. I really like how this feels, it's super lightweight and super easy to blend, and it just looks super pretty, and it's $5, so. I used this in my homecoming tutorial, I believe. So if you want to see how it looks, then you can go watch that. Okay, and then I have another foundation. This is the Milani Conceal and Perfect 2-in-1 Foundation. And this is so good, too. This one has a pump, which is always nice. And I actually think this pump is so cute. Just the little, like, finger spot. <laughs> it's really lightweight. It goes on easily. Blends out nicely. Has good coverage. And I just think it's such a good drugstore foundation. And another thing from Milani, this is the Milani Baked Blush in Luminoso. If you watch makeup videos, you know so many people like this. So it's just a baked blush and it has like a sheen to it. So it gives your skin a really pretty luminous glow. And it's a really pretty peachy color. Good for spraying, guys. The pigmentation of these blushes are really good also. It just gives you that really fresh blush look and yeah i really like it okay next we have the maybelline fit me a loose finishing powder so this is just a loose powder as it's called and the cool thing is this is from the drugstore so if you don't want to spend 40 dollars on laura mercier you can spend like eight dollars on this and it's really finely milled and they have different colors too and what I really like about this is using it to like bake under like my contour and stuff because I love getting that crisp line but like with my Laura Mercier it leaves too much of like a white cast in my opinion. So using like a colored powder is really good because you get that line but also it just is the color of your skin. And this powder is super good even for like setting your under eyes. So good. Definitely recommend especially for the price. Next we have the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and guys... I know I'm late to the game on this one, I know it came out like a year and a half ago, but I never bought it because I don't have an Ulta by me, and it's an Ulta exclusive, they don't sell it at Sephora, and I would have just ordered it, but I didn't know my shade, and like ordering like foundation or concealer online just like, I don't like it, so I don't do it, um, and I finally went to an Ulta on like spring break and got this and guys it is so good you can literally use the tiniest bit and it goes the longest way super good coverage i mean like you know this i want you to know that i i approve <laughs> it's really good i love it all right and then i'm not sure if i mentioned this in my last month's favorites i probably did but the abh and amreezy highlighter still loving it literally the best i used it on people for prom and it's just so beautiful just that like glow from within and it's so like wet and it just looks like your skin and it's beautiful and I just literally probably the best highlighter that has been made. A, a newer product this is the Smashbox Super Fan Mascara and I have a little sample size. I work at a makeup studio that carries a Smashbox so I got like a little sample one so I could try it out. And it, guys, this mascara is super good. It has a rubbery applicator, which I don't like. I usually like the big bristly applicators like the Better Than Sex and the Lash Paradise. Like those are my kind of applicators. I really don't like um, plasticky ones, but this mascara is just so good for like if you want length and separation in your eyelashes. It literally just makes your eyelashes like fan out like it's called super fan. Like it literally does that. So yeah, really good mascara. I enjoy it. Also, Smashbox's new liquid liner, they're always on liner, literally like the best liquid liner I've ever tried. Um, I don't have it, 
but I use it on like clients and stuff. So good. Definitely go get it if you have the chance. And then I have two ABH glosses and these are so pretty. I got these for homecoming because I couldn't decide which one so I got both. I have the shade Toffee and Kristen. These glosses are literally like so pigmented, so beautiful. So this one is Toffee. So it's just a nude with like a more brown undertone. I literally love it. This is the one I ended up wearing. It's so good. It smells delicious as well. And here's Kristen. So Kristen has like that more of like a berry color and then Toffee is in that more warm brown sugary color. Yeah, I just think those glosses are so beautiful. They have such good pigmentation. Like the first swipe you get your color. So you don't need to wear anything under it. You can wear them alone which is what I did, and they honestly last a really good amount of time for a gloss. I only reapplied this at dinner for prom, and it was pretty good. And I just think they're super pretty, and the gloss isn't like shimmery or glittery or anything. It just gives a really nice shine. All right, we have come to the last item, and we have all these little guys. So, these are a bunch of glitters from the brand House of Sparkles, and this is a UK brand. So I follow them on Instagram, and they always have like little promotions going on. They have so many pretty glitters. They have like fine glitters, chunky glitters, and they have lashes, and they just came out with a new highlighter palette that looks bomb. And they have literally every color you could ever want. So I have 10 glitters, and then I have Glitter Fix, which, which is their little glitter glue. I'm loving using these, and I just haven't filmed with them yet because I can't decide which ones I want to use in a look so let me know like what color look you guys want to see and I'll definitely incorporate these so I just want to show you guys the ones that I have I'll just go through them kind of quickly and show you so the first one is cinnamon and cinnamon is like a gold with like some darker like brown colors in it I don't know um next we have champagne it's like a gold and silver mix it's really pretty I love that um this one is called rose gold and it's rose gold <laughs> um next we have chocolate and this is such a pretty warm brown glitter this one is called gunmetal and i honestly think this is my favorite it's such a cool like cool tone gray glitter it's not silver it's like a dark gray i think it's so cool and so unique laguna which is a really cool fun like pool blue color this one is called amber it's just like a warm burnt orange color that is super pretty this would be so pretty in the fall and next we have sweetheart which is this pink mixture but it's not like a bright pink i just really like i don't know but i think the color is really cool and this one's super fun this is called juniper and it's a green and then lastly we have a black which is called noir i think black glitter is so cool so i was really excited about that i think they retail for like 250 or something like that but they always have sales going on like 10 for 10 20 for 20 so i think i got all of these for like a little bit over a dollar each which is so good and also i actually have a code with them for you guys so if you want to order from them like i said they have so many different glitters they have really cool lashes um i always see pictures they're so pretty i really need to get some but yeah anything you order from their website you can get 15 percent off with the code beauty by anna grace so just type that in at checkout and you will get 15 percent off I will link them down below as well as write my code for you guys. So that is it for this video, you guys. I hope you like it. Sorry I haven't been uploading. I'm literally just like, everything's crazy right now. Let me know what you guys want to see because if I have video ideas, that will make it so much easier for me to find time to sit down and film and edit and upload. I hope you guys have a great day. Thank you so, so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.